Hi, my name is Jenna Viverka. I'm a music teacher and a trumpet player. My name is Katie Eric, and I'm an arts manager. In our work in the arts, mine is a support role in Jenna's as a musician. We can't help but notice that there just aren't enough women playing brass instruments professionally. I am frequently the only woman in the trumpet section, and even growing up in elementary school and high school, I was the only girl, uh, not necessarily even in the trumpet section, but the entire brass section. And later on in college, um, as I got involved with brass quintets and smaller ensembles, um, per usual, I was the only woman in the group, and a lot of times when there's that typical brass stigma of um, a masculine mentality and attitude, you know, there can be some inappropriate joking and comments that come up. I was expected to just bite my tongue, or had I spoken up, and when I did, the group dynamic and um, the vibe between our friends and our camaraderie definitely changed, and I, and I would have upset that, which is actually a very important thing for any ensemble um, if you want to be a successful ensemble. Um, and I think it's incredibly important for myself and for young girls out there to have more role models, have more um, successful women out there who are making great careers and making headway in the music world, uh, especially female brass players. We just need to see it out there. And we did some research for this project and discovered that um, even though we've always heard anecdotally that there just aren't enough role models, there just really aren't. And the top 10 orchestras in the U.S., uh, generally there's only one to three women in the entire brass section of 11 to 15 people. The only way to fix this, of course, is to encourage more girls and young women to continue playing brass instruments. So this summer we are bringing together brass playing girls with professional brass playing ladies for a full day of learning and collaboration. It's completely run by women, taught by women, and for young women. Yes, on Saturday, July 16th, we will be taking over the Pittsburgh Cultural Trust's Art Education Center downtown. We will have up to 40 high school girls who play any brass instrument. They will have the opportunity to learn from established professionals through a full day of workshops, master classes, ensemble rehearsals. And at the end of the day, we'll be giving a faculty featured recital, open, free and open to the public, and then the students will perform at the end as well. The mission for this Key of She Brass Workshop and our goal for this project is to develop the musical knowledge and abilities of young brass players, to advance gender equity in brass sections, to empower young women to pursue opportunities in male-dominated fields and to connect young brass players with peers and professional mentors. We need $800 to make this project happen. We know that this is a realistic goal and we really believe in the impact that being around so many professional women will have on these girls. Absolutely, but we need your help. So please consider donating whatever you can. Every little bit counts and be assured that every dollar that you give will be used to simply just cover the overhead costs like the venue, the food, the website, making this video. And if we do exceed our goal, even if it's just by one penny, we will use it to pay our faculty and support our guest artists. Whether or not you're able to donate your money, we'd appreciate it if you could donate your time by sharing this video with your friends, your family, and your colleagues. And everyone you know. <laughs> Thank you so much. We are so excited to see what we can do together.